Happy National Lego Build Day, Brick Dudes and Brickettes. Today is December 27th, and I am Brickman USA, and I thought today is no better day than go get some new Lego. First stop we have to make is Bricks and Minifigs. And if you haven't heard of Bricks and Minifigs, it is a buy, sell, and trade Lego shop with new, retired, and used sets. Here is the retired section. They have some awesome sets, such as the Taj Mahal, the Sith Infiltrator, and up top, the Gungan Sub. All new in box for, in my opinion, some relatively fairly prices. And then up top, we have the Monster Fighters Haunted House, and here is their built set selection. Honestly, looking a little lackluster right now, but due to the holidays, I think that's the reason why. See the upside down set, awesome set right there. And then right there, you see we have Brick Daddy, one of my favorite minifigures all time. He's an awesome fig. At this Bricks and Minifigs location, they had this awesome Harry Potter display out made by Den Lug. It is really awesome Harry Potter Winter Village, and it is really detailed and has a lot of awesome sets and minifigs in there. How cool. Now we're taking a look at some of their figs, and honestly, I was a little disappointed in their LEGO Star Wars fig selection. They didn't have any really exclusive or hard to find figs that I was looking to get, but I still did pick up some mini figs in the DC and the Ninjago area. They had this awesome little Ninjago display right here. And here are some crazy and rare sets that are pretty hard to find, and man, do they catch a pretty penny, obviously. And one of my favorite built sets that they had was the Silent Mary, and then they also had some of the older Hogwarts stuff, and here's their new in-box selection. As you guys as can see they have a lot of the new releases a lot of the current stuff on the shelves overall just a pretty awesome store the next stop of the day we have to check out is the lego store one of my favorite places in the world to go let's jump in it the first thing that caught my eye in the lego store was this awesome little winter village setup they had with the home alone house they also had this awesome duplo frog that a little kid can go in and take a picture in. i thought it was really cool and there's a brand new eiffel tower what an amazing set here is some of the new and box stuff, but one of the sets that I was really surprised to see here was Assembly Square, a set from 2017 and an awesome modular in my opinion. And the shelves at the Lego store are looking a little thin due to the cr recent Christmas season, but you guys know they will stock them soon. They had some awesome sales at this Lego store, like the Mandalorian Starfighter for 20% off, also with the Bad Bat Shuttle with a little bit of a discount. You don't see that very much. And I've been seeing this on TikTok a lot recently, and I just wanted to scan to see which fig I was. There was this little kid next to me, and he kept saying that I was going to be a little swimmer fig, but I honestly didn't think I was going to be that fig. I was really excited to see what I was going to get, and it turned out that I was just the bunny rabbit. What a little funny coincidence. And one of the last things I did at the Lego store was try out the mini fig maker. I've seen these at a few stores, and I've never given it a chance, and I decided to make my own fig, and man, is it worth it in my opinion. Retailing for $11.99, you get to print the front and back of your torso, whatever you like to see, and you get to see it be made. Just look at that right in front of me it is such an awesome process and the lego store employees were very friendly and were very kind to me during the process and here's the little awesome box you get after you're done it's very cool and i really love the display lego went with these boxes open it up here you can see my custom brickman usa minifig and i really love this fig probably my favorite part of this fig is that custom usa flag i did there it took me like five minutes there Really awesome. If you haven't done this yet, I really suggest you guys do it. An awesome experience at the Lego store. And here are some of the sets I picked up. I picked up the horse transporter today and the four plus a little helicopter. And then I also got this VIP pack. Just some little small stuff before the big January 1st releases. I'm looking forward to building these sets with my girlfriend's sister. And last leak we have today is 40580, the Black Tron Cruiser. And this is gonna be a gift with purchase starting January 1st. And how sweet is this? Another classic Lego GWP. I love all these classic GWPs and I really think Lego needs to keep doing it as it really, in my opinion, brings a lot of hype to the GWPs and makes people rush to the Lego store. Well, thank you guys so much again for watching this vlog and i'm sorry again for the absence just took a little break due to christmas but thank you guys so much if you made it to the end make sure to drop a like and subscribe i got a lot more content coming soon and let me know in the comments down below which set you're most excited to get for january 1st i will be at the lego store day one vlogging it and getting all my pickups thank you so much for watching brickman Ooh!